Oh, wrestling fans, Doyle King here with the Houston, Texas at the uh, Toyota Center. I was going to welcome you tonight for uh, Terror in the Isles. Yeah, it is a big sports weekend. We got that big football game going on there. But for all you non-football fans and hardcore wrestling fans, we got Terror in the Isles for you tonight. And it'll leave an impact on you so uh, badly that you won't even have to worry about the Super Personally, I, you know, my, my team got out because of the call, so, uh, you know what, I'm not even going to get into that. That's got me so hyped up, it's not even funny. But right now, we're going to take you to Bobby Six Killer, the general manager. As, uh, he's going to have a lot to talk about. I mean, uh, tonight there are some big matches going on in this card. I wouldn't tell you that much right now. Let me tell you that much. There is, uh, world title matches galore. I mean, tonight, it could be terror. It is called Terror in the Isles, and the bad news about it is it could be Terror Inc.'s night. Two world title matches for them. Tag team title match. Because that's what happens when you got a devious genius like Gary Hart who watches everything he does. I mean, like him or hate him, he is a uh, he is a guy that watches out for his uh, proteges until I guess he doesn't need them anymore. But right now we're gonna get the Bobby Six Killer here, who's got probably something to say, and that's probably going might be dealing with one certain Mister Clean dude named Ronnie Taylor, or Lex Luthor one, I be. Ah, good evening, everybody. Hey, welcome here tonight. Terror in the Isles. I don't really care for the title because it deals with a certain group that's uh, really giving us pains and get pains and groans. But you know what? I guess I got to deal with it. But let me tell you something right now. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, I could not stop Ronnie Taylor from getting his rematch because, number one, his lawyers, and number two, he did bring back Angie. So I got to give him that. But you know what? Ronnie, I got some news for you, buddy. Tonight, your match is going to be a last man standing match with Billy Paul. That's right, for the WWE title. You better be prepared to take a lot of punishment. You better be prepared to give some back if you want that freaking title back. Because I'll tell you what right now. I don't think I'd see it happening. Billy Paul's been on a big, big one as a man. You know? I mean, he's having like, he, he's, he's like Kenny Omega a couple months ago. I mean, only in Krogel won. Had to vacate the TV title to, uh, win, as he won that WWL title. That's the only way he lost that TV title. He had to vacate it, but, you know. Also tonight, Charlie against Duck Dealer in the last man standing match. We also got Bratnell Palmer, the fit of the title against, <laughs> excuse me. Mr. Amazing, an extreme rule fan. Man, change of weather kind of like, uh, pours up my allergies here. I am so sorry. Got women's title match. Dawn Bats, it's going to go after Cheyenne. They got, uh, Akira going after Miss Wonderland. We got all kinds of stuff coming on here, you know? It should be a dandy of a card here tonight. We got a four-way tag title tornado match tonight for the Street Profits. Looking against three experienced teams. All right, guys, you've been great. Enjoy the event, ladies and gentlemen. Hope I don't, hope you don't disappoint. All right, Bobby Six Killer. Great to have him. Great to have him here in this glorious day. He's doing a little bit better after getting roughed up by Ronnie. Uh, I think it was Monday, if I'm correct. Well, here we go, folks. Liz Mark Jr. is going to start off against Ray Phoenix here tonight. Smart Jr., the international recruit for uh, Terror Incorporated, 
and he was pretty impressive to Pete. A veteran, he, I remember watching this guy in WCW, and he has changed, man. I'll tell you what, bad attitude and millions of tattoos later, man. Now, you know what? I would not think this is the same Liz Mark. He used to come out in this shiny silver mask and blue tights in WCW. If you ever watch Monday, you probably, you guys probably watch Monday Night Raw. Or oh. that great Lucha, Luchador in, Invasion. The likes of Rey Mysterio, Vampiro, Conan, the late great, the uh, great Eddie Guerrero, the uh, Aparka, Psychosis, Hubertu. I mean, whole hell lot of great competitors from south of the border. Now there's probably some few uh. Well, they have different opinions about it, but who knows? You know what? You probably weren't watching the same show as I am, and that's a shame. But this should be a dandy of a matchup. Phoenix looking to get singles gold after he saw his partner win the late heavyweight to 30 minutes past weekend on Jungle Ground. Let's get this bout going. As you see on his uh, tights, it says Mexican King. And that's what he is. He is a, he is a great app. I heard rumors that uh, him and uh, Pentagon might be challenging LAX and Impact. So, I would love to see those guys get the title. <coughs> oh, yeah. Six killer with. <coughs> We're kidding about the allergies down there. <coughs> but there's Vampiro along with Lizmark. And his opponent, oh, accompanied that, by Dan Pierre O. And yes, from Mexico, weighing in at 263 pounds, Liam How much a role Vamp Girl is going to play in this matchup if uh, Lismark does get the victory? Probably maybe play a major role. Who knows? You know these Terror Inc. guys, how much of, of a strong, loyal bond they got. Oh, and uh, he just, oh man, he just nailed Phoenix with a nasty forearm shot. Oh, he misses, and oh, Phoenix. That quick agility gets, keeps anybody, keeps him in, the, in any game. There you go, Phoenix, with a nice arm twist, and now into the hammer lock. Oh, and uh, Phoenix with a beautiful tornado DT. He dropped by Phoenix. And look at Phoenix getting, oh man, come on, fam. Leave him alone. Oh, zigzag. By Phoenix, uh, by uh, Lismark. Great to have you here with us tonight. Can't join us right now. You can always 
watch the replay later on on uh, YouTube. You like what's going on there on YouTube? Like, subscribe, put your comments in. If you're one of these guys that like to do all, if you, if you represent talents around the uh, virtual wrestling circuit, let us know. Maybe we can uh, get you signed up here for, for, uh, for a contract for a match for a while. I mean, it would be great to see. Her, yeah, Six Star has been rolling around the world for uh, new talent. And uh, cooperating with Jam Championship Wrestling from Hollywood. Rumors is there might be a few people he likes to bring in there, like Royce Isaacs. We keep hearing about. Not be surprised I see him coming here. And oh man, spinning suplex into a. Oh, it looks like a cutter, but I think it's more like a neck breaker. And now Lizmark has got it. Oh, what Phoenix. Showing that resiliency as he hits that arm and. Oh, unfortunately not in. Oh, there's a shin breaker. And, oh, right in the corner. Media, you can join uh, Joe Kenny tomorrow night on on uh, what's it? You can join Joe Kenny tomorrow night on Xbox Live as he's gonna be playing uh, State of the K2, aka Vampiro 712. The Vamp will be playing uh, State of the K2 tomorrow night. I join him. I don't know if he's going. He, he might be going you. He'll help you out with your community. He'll, he'll help you on daybreak, whatever you want. It says he is a virtual zombie killer for hype. He does to his opponents. And he's been a he's been a zombie killer against Terror Rank here. He's been killing them in like zombies because he's he has scored like four straight victories. Nice. Punishment Evan. And of course there was Sean O'Hare and there was Steve Blackman. Oh, our Phoenix, beautiful. Yeah, I love the Lucha guys, they are awesome. Now the Lucha get really popular in the United States until WCW called When Worlds Collide, which was really great. That's where we got our first look at Eddie Guerrero and uh, the Wolf Machine, aka Art Bar. Onan. Demon, uh, Arca, numerous guys in there. Maybe, maybe one of these days you might see one of those guys pop up. I would not be surprised. Oh man, if Phoenix, oh man, what's Vamp doing? He did he throw a chair in that ring? You get kidding me. He's gonna try to, gonna try to put the. The uh, advantage back in Liz Mark's way in an uh, illegal way? Oh man. Right now, oh, and uh, now Liz Mark's got, uh oh, what's going on here? Oh, beautiful sunset. Yeah. I don't know why Liz Mark needs uh, to be with Terry Corporate. He is a talented actor. Oh man, German suplex. Nasty. I guess uh, Liz Mark came in and Matt Taven had to go back to Ring of Honor, right? He'll be back here down the road. Right now he's defending six mantels along with his kingdom members, TK Orion and uh, Vinnie Mars Agella. I think I said the name. Let me know. I would greatly appreciate it. And oh, DDT. Liz Mark is, uh, I think Phoenix is just distracted by Vampiro at ringside. Of course, Pentagon's not here right now. I think he's, got, I think he's rustling down in uh, Mexico right now. Who knows? And here's that hesitation glitch happening. Come on. And there we go. It could just, oh, board buster. Chains of Iron Anderson right there. Or else, AK, the front layout suit. Looks beautiful. You know what? Ah. And Lewis Mark going for the pit. Is that it? 
Oh, Phoenix kicks out barely at 2.8. Holy cow. Man. And right now, Lewis Mark is going, is going to take it to Phoenix. He's going to try to punch him more. And, oh, oh, man. And, oh, man. He is just throwing him now with fist at the fifth. Oh, and a nasty jump and close one. And there's a German suplex. Oh, that's deep. Oh man, rams the arm. Oh, and Phoenix kicks out again. Are you kidding me? Wow. Oh, he's got some resiliency. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what, Phoenix probably wishes that stick. I, I think I think the people in Stanford wish that they could sign Phoenix and Pentagon. Luckily, they're not with them. I'll tell you that much right now. You know, I, I gotta give my personal opinion. They don't need to be in. Uh, they don't need to be in Stanford. They're 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 great individuals on their own, but this part was still a pick for you tonight. Wow. This match still shown intensity and the aggressiveness that, that has uh, made him survive in this Russell circuit for years. Here's a question I want to know. You know what? Blitzmark said, God knows, maybe his uh, old tag team partner might come here, Rollick. Everybody remembers Rollick. That spells killer backwards. Was another nasty individual. He and Brolic ever hooked up, and uh, as I guess, uh, what's uh, was it? Liz Mark gets to be a terror rank member. That would be scary. Nonetheless, Liz Mark gets a victory here against very impressive against Phoenix. After a second quarter, here is Boston. your winner. Liam. I'll tell you what, throughout the years, Lismark has really beefed up, I'll tell you that much right now. To be a small guy in WC. And here we go, folks. We'll be back with more action. Stay tuned. And here is Hot Stuff Hops. And Beautiful pink haired Amazon. I think she might explain about what's going on with her and Akira, I guess. They had a little miscommunication there. Hello, folks. Robbie Towers here, and I'm here with uh, Hot Stuff Pops. And what you gotta say? You'll find out. Oh, gee, short and sweet. Back to you guys. Well, thank you, Robbie. And right now we're gonna see the uh, beautiful uh, pink hair there, and there she is, folks. You know, if I was 20 years younger, I'd ask her for a date. Oh, hello, you Houston Helm, Helm Dogs. Welcome. Welcome to our show tonight. Tonight, we're going to we're gonna get a big buttload of gold. Five titles we're going to grab tonight. I'm going to tell you that much right now. And I guarantee you, you'll do well. 
And tonight we're also, you know what, we have, there's rumors of us hiring another new recruit. Yeah, she's here tonight. Let me tell you that much right now. And you're going to be pretty damn surprised who the hell she is. I mean, the women's division is, we're, we're, we're putting everybody on notice that we are nobody to sneeze at. Tracy Torman, Vixen's Club, the Yurohara Shoten, the, uh, the Bennett family. Yeah. You know, I'm going to tell you what right now. The Wyatt Squad? Absolutely not. Oh. And then she said, absolutely not, make an insult and absolution. Look who comes down the ring. Andy Rose. Oh, man, here he comes. And Andy Rose does not look too happy right now with Hobson. Mandy Rose telling, looks like she's got a few words for Hop, so he did not even hear. Ah, oh, absolutely not. Make me laugh, Hobson. You got dropped on her head by one. Who went to two trips to Wonderland and came back with no, nothing after their matches? You sure did, didn't you, lady? Let me tell you something right now, Hobson, you know? You're a powerful individual, and I'll give you that much, but you know what? You you, you let your mouth run your life. I let my mouth run my life because you know what? I can back it up. I can destroy a person within a single inch. Wonderland, Wonderland just got lucky. She's holding on to that title until one of us terroring people is going to get it. And I got a feeling we're going to see a new champion when the chops her down the chops the Wonderland tree down the size. Well, I know, I know something, you know what? I see you don't have a match on the card. I'll tell you what, I'll make you a deal. How about, uh, we go at it tonight. I wouldn't mind not, I wouldn't mind slapping a, slapping a hiss out of you, you know? You, you, you know what? You're enough of a big overgrown serpent that could be slain at any time. They're wrong, dear. I am a serpent, all right. I am the serpent that's going to squeeze you to I'm gonna put my death work on you and I'm gonna squeeze your throat so you can never run that little mousy little mouth again. Get out. And I will. Oh, really? This is gonna be fun tonight. I'm gonna tell you how much right now. You're underestimating, but you forgot. I am a two time TV champ, I am a former Women's Tri American champ. I have been tiles a while ago, you know? But you also screwed up relationships in your uh, in your other area that you're at? Well, wow. What happened? You obsessed over an Uso so much that uh, your boyfriend broke up with you. So you know, you have nobody, miss. You have no one. Except for your little queen. Bruner, uh, Sonia De Sonia DeBille. That is DeBille. And she is my best friend. And I'm going to tell you that much right now. And you know what, Hobson? You know, you know, you, 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 how dare you bring your lady, my relationship out in the open? What about you? You know? I don't see Duckfield, I don't see you around the arm of Duck, around the, your arm around Duckfield anymore, is it? Or somewhere else? Well, and Hop, and Hop, oh man, Hobson just smacked Rose, oh my gosh. And Hobson now going to work on Mandy Rose. And Bob, it was as I hear, Bobby six year trying to get him up right now. Don't you see a match between these two?
shut the entrance off on this because they're already in the ring. It's like, what would be the use of having the entrance on when they're already in the ring? There you go. Set this up right. <laughs> Sometimes I have a bad habit of not doing that. My fault. But it's official coming up next. Hot Stuff Hobson against Mandy Rose. So far, Terror Inc. is 1-0 so far. I notice how fans are been real geeks as of late. Calculating to see how good Terror Inc. does on a certain night. Well, Jungle Ground, I don't think they won a single match at all. But they seem like they're rebounding pretty damn quick. If you notice, on the TV title in the Rumble, Punishman and Vampiro have punched their ticket in for the uh, for a match tonight. And then, uh, Death Dealer last night watched the Thursday showdown on Shockwave Wrestling, and I suggest you to. He beat Alex Brimstone for the hardcore title. Here we go, folks. A rumor says that Hobson says there's a new recruit in it. If uh, she shows up here tonight, there is. Says there is she says there's so much, uh, what is it, uh, yeah, there's uh, so much uh, holes in the uh, women's division of uh, Terran Corp. What the heck? Okay. Oh my god. Shayna Baszler? Are you serious? Shayna Baszler? Oh, wait a minute. Come on. Oh, man. Oh, come on. Shayna Baszler, and that's it, Mandy Rose will win by disqualification, but, oh man, Shayna Baszler, that was a surprise, holy cow, and this Hobson did not mind giving up that victory in order to display Baszler, oh man, freaking kidding me, fans, we'll be right back, horrible. Coming up next, national title on the line, Florida City Mike, take on El Hijo del Serpentro. National title. After uh, Florida City Mike was eliminated by Serpentro in the uh, day, Serpentro asked Florida City Mike if he wants to do it again this Friday. There was no problem. I mean, Florida City Mike did not ban an eye. Did not bat an eyelash to answer that. Shayna Baszler? Are you serious? I'm sorry. You know what? I'm shocked. I thought Shayna Baszler was a lone wolf, and uh, looks like now she's joined the ranks at Terra Incorporate. Holy cow. This is unbelievable, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go, folks. The following contest oh, that is one hell of an acquisition. It is for the National Heavyweight Championship. Here comes Motor City Mike. Ready for this bout, folks. Where is City Mike? Right, ready to try for an opportunity to see if he can get a chance to win the uh, the title that eluded him Wednesday night, the national title. So Pentor threw him over the top. Got the win. Serpentor, he does not mind the competition. That's the reason why 
he gave Morris City Mike another opportunity to see if he, can, once he, uh, if he wanted to uh, go at the title. But he was telling me. And there he is, folks, Morris City Mike. I, I think, uh, you know what, I guess he's wearing that until football season is over, which, which will be Sarah, Sunday when Super Bowl happens. After that, I think you might be seeing him wearing the Chicago Cubs again. And there he is, folks, the national heavyweight champion. No, you'll know some mentor. Here we go. And there, ah, look at the acrobatics. Beautiful. Very agile athlete from his height and stature. He's like six foot five, uh, 250 to 255 pounds. Don't underestimate more city Mike either. Introducing the challenger from Detroit, Michigan. Detroit Rock City, he's 255 pounds. But the weird thing about it is like the he doesn't know who he cheers County for in baseball. He always wants to see, he says his dream series of a World Series matchup would be the Tigers and the Cubs. He's a fan of both teams. Introducing the champion from San Juan, Puerto Rico, weighing in at 265 pounds. He is the heavyweight champion, the superstar. There you go, right there, as you see Serpentor with the belt. This kid's been excited. I mean, he made an impact uh, earlier this year when he won the uh, World Cup tournament to beat Anu Premji in the finals. Of course, he make, of course, he's, he, you know what, that'd be another uh, accolade to his career as uh, he's, held every, he's held a hell of a lot of titles there. He has a... You know what, uh, for a short time he has become a grizzled vet. And Serpentor with a nice arm twist. Now goes around. Nice hammer lock. And now look, uh oh, and oh. Yeah, beautiful reversal by Morrison. Push you not to take your eyes off the prize. Oh, and there's a suplex. Shayna Baszler is the newest recruit to uh, Terror Incorporated. What the hell? Serpentor going for the sunset flip. Oh, beautiful. Sunset flip power bomb. Wow. I mean, it's like a variation of Canadian Destroyer, but just in a power bomb thing, not like a pile, not like a flipping pile driver. It's Canadian Destroyer made famous by Petey Williams. And now. Motor City Mike slamming Serpentor's arm in the mat. Oh, and there's a beautiful elbow there by Serpentor. Or how uh, Motor City Mike, I think he's a little distracted by the fact that Alan B is now a member of Terror Incorporated. Of course, Alan B's been calling himself the Amazing Son. Mr. Amazing, the MSW. Well, well, the former MSW World Champion, but he's got an opportunity to grab it again tonight. Everything works out his way. Oh, Mercy Mike, that, that's not Metallica playing on this turnbuckle. That is Mercy Mike's head playing on this turnbuckle. Oh, and there's a nasty forearm. Wow. Oh, missed, missed the forearm for goal and a close one. Wow. Oh. 
Oh, beautiful drop kick. Oh man, and there's a there's a shot by Serpentor. It's getting a little rugged here now. I mean, even battles between friends can get a little rugged sometimes. Which is what would be the aftermath. There's a suplex. Goes on more city Mike back in. Elbow to that face. And now where's he going, Des? Ah. Jumps right over. I thought he's gonna do something spectacular there. Oh man. Uh oh. Oh, beautiful back suit. Wow. Go for the pin. He gets it. Wow. Serpento wins. Retains the national title. Spectacular athlete. Play that much right now. Enough about respect in the world. Oh, you don't go so into it. Motor City Mike looks a little dejected. Holy cow, what, what is going on here? Oh, man. Wow. Oh. Knows. Fans, we'll be right back with more actions. Stay tuned. Oh, are you kidding me? We're just now getting to the back now. We see Braun Strowman and Billy Paul going in in the back. Are you kidding me? Come on. This is all plot by Ronnie Taylor to make his match easy tonight. Ah, uh, the, the 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 misery and evil of Death Comp Five. I swear to goodness. Here we go, folks. Billy Paul, they're ch exchanging words here, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, and Billy Paul, go right at it. Mm -hmm. Oh man, there's a kick. <clears throat> right now. Oh man, it, oh, right, oh, come on. What the heck? Oh man. Where's Billy, where's up Ron Strowman trying to make me long Come on, where's the security at? Come on, man. Where's Luke? <laughs> oh, man. Billy Paul hits it again. <laughs> And bronze. Oh gosh, that has to hurt. Huh. Now Billy Paul. Huh. Oh. Oh man, are you kidding, man? Billy Paul trying to, trying to go out with the, the monster among men. Oh, right there, man. Come on. Oh, man, there's a kick by Braun. Oh, man, ouch. 
Holy Paul is just getting drilled. Just got drilled. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. Like what Ronnie Tier likes to call silly Billy. Hm. Oh, right to the table. Oh man, is Billy Paul gonna be able to wrestle here tonight? I hope so, man. I'm sure the fans want to see him wrestle. Oh, what the heck? Daniel Bryan's out here? Oh gosh. Is he gonna is he gonna pick on us because we're all meat eaters? He's gonna pick on us just because we're going after that foot long hot dog or that burger? And letting the fans really have it these last couple of weeks. I mean, everywhere he's been, he's been like ridiculous. I'll tell you that much right now. Here we go. Let's get this going here, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, look at all you Houston half-breds here, you know? Let me tell you something right now. You go and chow down in your burger or your hot dog and your ch chicken tenders and everything else, but you know what? I don't go for that, man. You all stink. Let me tell you something right now. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, you know what? The new Daniel Bryan here is here to enlighten you not to do that. Because you're going to grow dumber and dumber by the minute. And let me tell you something right now. That's the reason why I am the WWE Champion on SmackDown and not AJ Styles. That's the reason why. You know what? I don't think nobody can compete with me here on Musty Wrestling. I'm, I'm going to climb that ladder and I'm going to grab that Musty Wrestling World title. Whether you like it or not. Don't you be saying yes to me out there. The yes movie is over with, idiot. Let me tell you something right now. And, you know, we're all going to have to deal with it. Oh, wait a minute. It's coming down the ring. Wait a minute. What's going on here? Ooh, it's coming down the ring, ladies. Oh, Joe Kenny. Holy cow. Kenny looks at Daniel Bryan. Daniel Bryan, I don't know, he's telling him to calm down here, but you know. What is going on with you, Daniel? You know? You used to be one of the most respected people, inspiration to everybody here. And look at you, now you're becoming a, a complete vegan hippie scumbag. And I don't mean that, and I don't mean that towards all vegans there, but you know what? You have like, uh, will pick on people because they're things and stuff like that. Different people come from different cultures and everything else, and uh, you know what? Respect it, Daniel. I prefer not to, Joe. Just like you. You're one of these little cannibals, aren't you? You go out there every night, you eat your opponent, and you go out there and eat your big steak and everything else that your little hoochie coochie fatal makes you, you know? I'm gonna tell you what right now. You don't want any of this. You know what? Screw that. I want some of it. You know what? Tonight, I'll tell you what, how about you and me go at it? How about you try to shut me? Because I'll tell you what, 
I think the odds are better that I'm going to shut you up than you shut me up because you, you're, you're, you're distracted by stupidity. Oh, what you gonna do? Try to get that Kenny claw on me and uh, freeze my hair like a grape? I'm not gonna let you do that. The question is, are you going to uh, are you going to sub? Are you gonna get out and yes lock like you're some kind of submission genius? But you take a look at my track record, buddy. I'm gonna tell you that much right now. Punishment Martinez went down. Evan Magnificent went down. Blackman, Dow, O'Hare, Dow. I have knocked out. I have knocked out bigger giants. And, you know what? You're you're a little guy, but I'm not going to underestimate you. I know you are a submission technical genius, and you know what? I know that. That's right, Kenny. I'm your superior. You are my inferior. You are nothing but a finer wrestler wrestling machine compared to me, buddy. And you and you know what? I'm gonna show that to you tonight. I am going to embarrass you. I am gonna I'm gonna make Patel wound, try to wound me instead of wound you. Always bring in your family. See that's a funny thing about it. I did not bring that I didn't bring that I didn't bring your Bella twins into it because number one, I make it between you and me. I don't make it between me and Brady. I don't make it between me and your uh, child, I don't make it between that. I concentrate who I want to go after. And tonight, I see you in my path. Oh, uh, okay, I see you don't fall for psychology, the psychological gene. Ah, uh, okay. You know what? That's fine. I'm just gonna beat you, I'm gonna make, I'm gonna submit you, I'm gonna attack you out. I'm gonna make you cry for your vulnerability. I'm gonna make you cry for your... I'm gonna, I'm gonna make your son cry. I'm gonna make your son's girlfriend cry. I'm gonna make everybody cry tonight. I don't believe it. You could try. I heard many people say, "Take a number, buddy." But you know what? I don't think you know. I don't think you're gonna do it, man. I will. I am gonna walk over. You. Maybe I won't walk over you, but I will have my hand raised. And Kenny telling the fans that he promises that he promises to take down Daniels. Holy cow! That is going to be a hell of a matchup. Kenny against Daniel Bryan. I'm going to tell you that much right now, ladies and gentlemen. That was an unexpected match. That wasn't even on the schedule. Well, coming up next, we got a three-team elimination, as we're going to see uh, Asuka, Ember Moon, and Ember Moon go against Jay Call and Angie Strange, and also Ruby Wright and Liv Morgan in a three-way dance for the women's tag team title. So stay tuned for this one, ladies. This is going to be unbelievable. Now, that's the thing about it. everybody by winning at Rumble. And you know what? In the in the thing about it, Sarah Logan was going to be the original partner until she betrayed the Riot Squad and joined Terror Inc., which gave Liv Morgan the opening to be that partner. And you know what? It worked. As a result, she is now the uh, tag team champion for the Riot. Well, let's get to the ring right now for this bout. Let's not. I think I heard the people are already in there. Here we go. Well, six people in the ring at the same time. Only way a tag team can be eliminated is by double elimination. That means if one member gets a pin, they're not done yet until the other person gets a pin. I 
where Ruby Riot gets out of it. The oh my god, Liv Morgan's already gone. Angie Strings going right for Amber Moon here, but uh, Oscar gets out and gets around with it. Wow. Ruby Riot's got a uh, hell of a uh, out in the climb. Oh, and Jade Cole is not going down yet. Is she going to work by dumb luck and hope the Asuka and Ember Moon can make uh, Maybe the Asuka or Ember Moon can make her job uh, a little bit easier. Maybe Jade or Ange. And Shay with a beautiful body press. Oh. And Jade and Angie just got nailed. Ember Moon. And of course, that's what they named. They decided to name themselves now Ember Moon and... Asuka, they are now known as Empresses of the Moon. And now they're just doing that. Oh, and a beautiful drop kick by Jane. I mean, for Moon. Oh man, and there's a, a drop kick, but they even stunned Ember. Ember now gets a headlock. Oh! Stoner on the ropes. Oh man, and Ember Moon just taking care of uh, Angie Strange here. Ember Moon and Oscar are nothing to sneeze at. Those girls, those two girls are awesome. Ain't that much right now. And with them together as a tag team, that's going to be a lethal tag team. And where, where is Ember going? Oh, beautiful vertical on. I thought she was going to go for that. Ooh, she does for the Eclipse. Oh, and, now, and also could get suplexed. I think it's a false count anywhere, too. For sure. And Angie Strange with the zigzag. Asuka comes in for a save against uh, Angie Strange as she was going to try to pin Ember. Now Ruby Riot going to work on uh, the fallen Ember move. Sure, way in the wings might be Terror Inc. We're gonna be wanting to capture this title as I noticed now they got now they got women that can cover all the areas of uh, each title. They have two titles already, but those two titles can be vacant. A competitor. That's a Jade Squad. Oh. Asuka and Number Moon are the only team in town. Holy cow. Oh, Asuka Lock. Oh. Oh. If Angie gives up, that could be it. And no, Angie gets out of it. But she's got her arms gotta be hurt. I don't know if the resiliency really pays off in that kind of And now Asuka taking Ruby Riot down and stomps on it in and right in the back. I mean, this is perfect pickings for Asuka and Ember Moon. I mean, they are, uh... Oh, man. There's that... 
Oh my god, Dragon Sleeper Clutch, basically. Creation of Dragon Sleeper. Very dangerous. And now, where's uh, I'm going with this? Oh, Super Clutch. Holy cow. And she. Uh oh. Oh, Tagnation Kick. Oh my gosh. Going for the pin is Ruby Riot. Ember Moon and Ember Moon is gone. Oh, Angel's Wings. Angel's Wings. And there's going to be new champions. Is it going to be Asuka and Ember Moon, or is it going to be Jade and Angie? I mean, Angie, she didn't really didn't have to come back, but she said she was willing to come back. And uh, you know what? It may turn out to be a good move. Uh oh, she's going to try to make Asuka submit. I don't know. As Asuka, not known to submit. Oh, right on the arm. Ouch. Maybe set it up there for the Asuka lock. Oh, it's a Noku driver. We get it. Oh, there's that dragon sleeper. Angie's in trouble. Ooh. I do not like seeing the neck bend like that, ladies and gentlemen. Oh man, it got frustrated and let go. She probably did a lot of damages. She probably did a lot of damage. The one Miss Angie Stranger got. Oh, Going for the pin. And Angie Strange still gets out. A glimmer of hope here, Russell. As one of these uh, girls are looking to see if they can grab those titles for their team. Asuka wins, it's gonna be her and Ember Moon. Angie wins, it'll be Angie and Jay. There's a lethal kick. Oh! Man, what a strike. Holy cow. Oh man, Asuka gets thrown in the corner and oh, Stinger Splash! Oh, Stinger Splash the best. I mean, uh, uh, who is it? If it's a bird guy, we'll call it the Avalanche. That splash has had a lot of impact on people that used it as their finisher most of the time. Sting. Sting with the Stinger Splash in the corner. Of course, you have Bundy with the infamous Avalanche Splash. Uh oh, Angel Swings. That could be it. Oh my gosh, that could be it. Oh, and Asuka kicks out. Holy cow. Unbelievable. Which, girl, which one wants it more? It's going to be a question. Go for that E in the back camel clutch combination. Asuka gets out of it. But she gets caught by Angie. Going in the ropes. Oh, snap power slam. Snap, there it is. Oh, beautiful standing drop. Oh, placed by Angie Strange. The daughter of uh, the now kidnapped Chaz once again, and also the granddaughter of Red Foreman. Oh, and there's an elbow right in the back. That could be it. Not quite macho, but it's effective. 
Oh, and Angie Strange still cannot close it up here, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, and there's a drop kick to the back of the head. And Go for that pin again. Oh, yeah, I can't do it. She going for oh turn oh turn for the power ball and she's playing on fuel and fire here ladies and gentlemen oh and there's another zigzag no i'm sorry that's a rocker drop oh hey breaker ddt can she go for the pin again? And no, Asuka still gets out. Oh, no, oh man. And Asuka with the, uh, uh that, that vicious butt bump. Going for the pin. Oh, and does not get it. There's those kicks. Oh man, vicious. A competitor That's it. has been Asuka and Amber Moon are your new tag team champions. Wow. Unbelievable. And she gave it her all. I'm gonna tell you that much right now. You gotta give her the credit where credit is due. Here you go, folks. Asuka, tag number team one. champion. Oh, women's tag team Asuka champions. And Congratulations, Moon. ladies. I'll tell you what, they, they're acting like a well-oiled machine. I'll tell you that much right now. I mean, they did well. Ember did her part, and Asuka definitely did her part. Well, ladies and gentlemen, coming up next, we got... ECW Tag Team Tunnels on the Line. TLC. Demolition against Demolition Man and a Threat. There it is, folks. Thank you to the viewers who are uh, joining us here. So oh, great to see you. Yes. Always a pleasure. Welcome to the land of must see, I like to call it.
All right. Here we are, folks. Cousins of Carnage. Look at that. Need that ECW tag team title. You know, I saw one title change hands. Uh, remember Moon and Asuka won their uh, title, title uh, won those uh, tag team uh, titles off uh, match. Here comes Double Ocean. There we go, folks. TLC rules ECW tag team titles on the line. Tables, ladders, and chairs. Oh, my. And right now, Smash runs in a threat. A threat is still no budge. Oh, and Smash now takes them all. The motion man nails it. So right now, ladies and gentlemen. Right now, working on Axe. After that. Let's get rid of the uh, smash there. And oh man, what a move. This axe is thrown under the ropes and oh, an axe is gonna make a pain. Well, ground and pound. Zine over the top sends up right down and now Smash would sell up that wire. It looks like he's going up the wire, ladies and gentlemen. See if he can attempt to take those belts down. Okay, Smash Balls, good strategy by X. He's gonna go and continue it.
Oh. Axe is going to get hit with all kinds of tables. Oh man, Axe is just getting nailed. There's a big uh, overbearing white to uh, Axe. Stomp again. And Devil Wisher Man doing a good job of protecting the court from any damage. There's a suplex brought back in the ring. If Ax can figure it out quickly, he can get those bumps down easily. I know both the cousins of Carter's are down. Oh man, somebody's going for a bar. Oh! Try and grab the belts again. Taking down his partner off the ladder. Oh. Wait them over ropes and just smash them. And Demolition wins a match in the ECW Tag Team title. Mr. Fuji not able to be there because managers were barred from the TLC match. And there you go, folks. Unfortunately, Smash got the too happy. Here are your winners, and still, ECW World Tag Team Champions, Axe and Smash Demolition.
Well, folks, stay tuned. We got more uh, action still. Uh, another segment upcoming. Stay with us. We'll be back in a few minutes.